Hey all, Rick Rex here, back with another one for you. And this time, we're starting up our look at the ICE power set. Now we're gonna start out with the single target, and boy is it something. Now we as always are gonna look at the mods, artifacts, allies, the spec, and the loadout. And of course with a little damage thrown in there for us to check out together as well. But first, if you like what you see and you want more, hit that like and subscribe button to help keep the channel growing and also to not miss one single update as they drop. And also, y'all make sure to drop a comment below and let me know what you think. Okay, so ice is pretty great all around. I've had a lot of fun with this one for sure, but let's hop into the single target. And as always, we're gonna start out with our white mods. In our weapon, we're going replenishing adapter, so if we run out of power, we can get it back quickly. And in our head, we're going supercharged ice elemental, and I'll explain that one for you in just a moment when I get to the loadout. And in our neck, we're going escalating might. In our back, we're using berserker as nothing really needs a jump start for timing on this one. And in our chest, penetrating strikes as always to ignore that defense on NPCs. In our legs, we're going restorative wintry tempest, and feet, tumbling master to keep us out of trouble. Now hands of course as always are max damage. Now for our artifacts, we're going for the trans strat solar combo on this one. Trans for the extra crits, strat to give us that innate damage from those crits, and solar amp for the bump in might extra damage to heat vision, and the empowered channeling mod for the win. Now for allies, we're using House of Legends since he is the king of single target, Batman who laughs for his luck of the draw ability and we gotta love those cards, and Emperor Aquaman for his hear my call buff to robot sidekick. Now looking at the build, with our weapon, no points are needed here as we just simply won't be using it. In movement mode, remember to take your super. And on the second row, one of your choosing, and then your innates. Y'all, acrobatics to the lower right, and everybody else to the left to the left. Now under Iconics, we're going to grab Heat Vision and Robot Sidekick only. And for the build, we're going to go Super Powered Focus, Max Atra Crit Attack Chance and Damage, and then throw everything else into Might and Power. With anything left over, put it directly into Health, because remember y'all, a dead DPS does no DPS. Now as far as stats go, we'll go ahead and take a look here right quick, but for comparison's sake, that puts Might at 165, 694. And now for the start of the show, and that's the loadout. So we're going with Wintry Tempest for the power interaction and the damage over time, Amplified Heat Vision, Ice Boulder Strike, and Glacier Flash rounded out with Robot Sidekick and Ice Elemental. Now we need to take it a step further with this one and throw the same loadout, Wintry Tempest, Amplified Heat Vision, Ice Boulder Strike, Glacier Flash, Robot Sidekick, and where Ice Elemental was, throw in Blizzard in this slot. So there's really two ways of going about this. You can throw Ice Elemental for the buff only throughout the raid, or you can treat this like a 100%er and throw Blizzard directly after you go into Ice Elemental. Blizzard hits like crazy if you do it in this manner as you get that nasty buff from Ice Elemental which applies to it as well. And if you have a green spammer, it allows this loadout to really really work well so you can kind of do a mixture of both if you choose. So there we go. Let's go on ahead and take a second to see what kind of damage this one puts out together.
Okay, so let's go ahead and start out with the bad, and that was the first parse. This is pretty normal considering your strat has not started to proc, plus your robot sidekick doesn't really begin until a few seconds after you do, plus those dots aren't really rolling yet. But after that it shaped up really nice with a high of 143.17 and another one in there pretty close at 136.458. Now the loadout looks to live right around the 110 to 115,000 range with some nice spikes, but no dips really to speak of. I love it. Now even though that parsed so well, it's time for my favorite part y'all. Let's drop everything. <laughs> Okay, so our big hit came in around 634,835 damage per second. And for those sitting in the back, y'all, that's over 6 million in damage, almost 6.5 in 10 seconds. So awesome on single target. That one is also followed up by one that's close to 200,000 at 193.002. So, y'all, that wraps up Ice Single Target. Thanks so much for joining. And once again, if you like what you see and you want more, Hit that like and subscribe button to help keep the channel growing and also to not miss one single update as they drop. I'll see y'all next time.